You know, kind of a little bit of an anecdotal story <clears throat> on uh, your initial point on who do you blame for AI? So like Christian and I live in Arizona and Phoenix is, you know, one of the three cities with Waymos and Waymos can pick you up at the airport. It's pretty cool now. But I was wondering what happens if an, a Waymo is in the wrong lane or there's a crash. Can you ticket a Waymo? And so I look it up and in Arizona, you cannot give a Waymo a ticket. You have to give a ticket to an individual and not a car. So if the car cr makes a traffic violation, even if it creates a hazardous situation, there is no one to blame. Oh, that's super interesting. And it's there is a shortcoming in the, the legal reporting structure. There is a mechanism through professional engineering to certify these devices and hold people accountable when something goes wrong. So in that case, the car would not get a ticket, but whoever certified the car would effectively get a ticket. That's correct. The individual that is in charge of the project, the individual that is licensed by the state to build uh, intelligent agents and deploy them into the real world would be held uh, responsible.